So it turns out Kickoff has lied again. Hello and welcome to Coastal Nation Fan TV. I am Bilo. I am your host. This is where fans meet and talk about the biggest club in South African football. Kaiser Chiefs. Amakusi Football Club. So in today's video, I want us to talk about Tutelimpi Longema, him coming to Chiefs, the lies that are being told about him. And also I want us to talk about the Nike sponsorship with the Kaiser Chiefs. Because there are a lot of things around that. So stay tuned because we'll talk about that thing. Now, in the Baga Tselimpilongema has been circulating around Uguti. Hey, uh, this guy is coming to achieve. So if you don't know who he is, he plays for I Marumokalans. And he's okay as a player. Plays as an attacking midfielder. And he's creative, obviously. Which is why he's being associated with Chiefs. However, Aksi Kuguti, like he's an incredible Luguti, Labadalisna, Bunjanga, Manjanga, Basulanje, Kalula. You know, it's not like he is lighting up the Premier Soccer League, Nje. He's the talk of the town. He's just one of those players who are good enough to be linked with the move away from him, Arumo Kalans, and who happens to be coming to the end of his contract, Mochun. And naturally so, he start being linked to other teams. And one of those teams being a case achieves. But today, there was a, a, a tweet on, 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 on Twitter. Tweets are on Twitter. That said, the Chiefs are leading uh, the way. Uh, I mean, are, are leading the race of signing with NP Long Game. And then, no case, I'm the Hong Chun. I just commented. was like, oh, come on. Really? Like, this is now ridiculous and this is thing is not happening. Which is the same thing that he did when we were talking about Ubonganzungu and I think someone else where Chiefs were associated with the move of that player, a move for that player, but then Kezam Taung Chune just came out and said, that's not happening. So this is not to say this is ruling out that move, but the fact that Kezam Taung Chun has publicly came out and said, Come on, that's not true. Then it's fair to assume Muguti Vele, that thing is not happening. It's just probably either the agents, either the agents are trying to increase Iveluyake by putting Ichiefs into the picture. Because if you've noticed, Uguti, if there is any player that's available, we PSL, even if Ichiefs is on phone, Uzo associates on Ichiefs, and then everyone else who says on phone because everyone knows usually if Chiefs wants a player that player must be good enough so if we Chiefs to if we don't belong to the champ into the race so we sign if we Chiefs if we don't belong to the Sundowns will know if they want this player then they know he will strengthen them so let's sign that player and make sure they don't get him because that's what Rulani kind of said about <laughs> about the left back Terence Mashir so yeah, we'll see what happens with that. Now, enough with the Bagatel Pilong game because Kazam Taung Chun has kind of said it's not going to happen. Let's talk about Inda by year sponsorship deal with Nike. Now, Nike has been in partnership with the Chiefs since 2001, I think. And that's like 21 years. 21 years of a partnership with the chiefs to a point you could see growing up i always hated adidas and loved the nike because i always associated the nike with the chiefs and adidas with the pirates and then even if something is nice a adidas i just didn't like it because the adidas and i thought mauko adidas you're basically a pirates fan if you ever felt like that in the comment section, it's just the power of marketing goodie. you end up associating a brand with your team and you think it's a good thing. And the reason why I'm talking about brand association like this with the Nike and the Chiefs, it's because the Chiefs and the Nike are actually not in a good relationship. They are not in a good relationship because this thing starts the one that was has been a that was a bigger issue in the 2019-2020 season when the COVID hit. The Chiefs we were celebrating the 50th uh, anniversary of the Chiefs and whatnot and whatnot. And Lelo Ches Lelo, 
apparently it wasn't designed by Nike giving it to Chiefs. It was designed by Chiefs and they pitched it to Nike Kuti. He's a kid that would love to have for a celebration year two this year. And then Nike took that same jersey, won Bahamba Balsawi Barcelona. Because Barcelona had the exact same kit. Exactly the same. The difference was Guti, Aksibu, Vodacom. It's just their sponsor. And then Nike, Barcelona. Uh, oh, which side? And Barcelona, Nike. That's it. Oh, we ain't fan. I'm going to go to Nike. But I just let it slide because I thought, you know what? It, 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 it happens. It's because no Puma, when they change the position, they put it centrally. But it design, I find exactly. I find exactly. But with that kit, that's strike number one. You don't do that. You don't do that. You celebrate a special occasion with our kit. And then when we touch, we'll say with Barcelona. Number two, it's been said so many times in the past few years, Uguti achieves a training kit here to Ifigalit. And by the way, what makes me bring this up today? It's because a training kit here achieves for this season only arrived today. Well, I'm not arrived today, but the players were only pictured wearing a training kit here this season today. That's 16 games after the season. We've played 13 games in the P in the in 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 the league, and then we've played three games with MT and eight. 16 games. That's practically halfway through the season. And Unaiki Ubunga Gaiwe Ubunga What kind of disrespect is that, Buffett? Like what kind of partnership is that? Why won't ye ni? Like I could have ordered something from America. I figure in three weeks, Leon Tole. And this is a special delivery to Ichivs. Uguti Ichivs in a jersey. And it's not even like a delivery, guys. It's a partnership. Aksiku Guti Nitengile and Nsalindi Lugutulete is in to or is to Kobus Otile. It's unavailable. Ka, ka, ka. The warm up kit is for Chiefs and only for Chiefs. And yet it delayed for so long. I put it for the first time. And I know good people will say, oh, these things happen. But if land is organized consistently, if land is organized consistently, good morning, but the change but delay, ugleta, it training kit achieves. Oguzo bagune inga somewhere. Oguzo tattoo design it because knowledge is the fiftieth edition. There is also uguti. It was made a limited edition. But early Barcelona was just made freely available, limited, and stuff like that. So, that are going on with Unike. And I feel like, yes, Unike is the biggest sports brand right now in the world. But that does not mean we should just sit down and take it. And I'm no way suggesting Guti Gege, Asiego, Puma, or whoever. But I don't think it's healthy for a brand, for a team as big as the Chiefs, to accept in nonsense as in the owner They will just delay us, let the warm-up kit, and then we'll just sit down and take it. Because, when this is over consistent, Uguti, people are getting used to disrespecting the Chiefs. Because the Chiefs, a brand in a month, I think Unike, Uguzube and Kool. The Chiefs, right now, they can get sponsored by Ukap, and they will make Ama shirt sales a Vela Skyrocket. And they will always come to Chiefs. Like uh, Liverpool, we are being dropped by all my friends. But when they sponsor us, my friends are still. What if you club with Liverpool? Yeah, Liverpool, yeah, performer. And all of a sudden, we new balance. We go here, we stick in a bo. Baby, sad little poor little petal. But when they perform a bit, what if you now? Because we figure out the deal. El improved. Ne mali. Because now they see Guti, we can make money from this. But if Guti Nike is disrespecting us and not recognizing Guti, Ikeza Chiefs is such a huge brand that deserves respect, then Ichiefs should find other partners. We should find other partners, Abazo respect the brand. And yeah, because Chiefs doesn't need anyone, to be honest. And maybe 
<laughs> because of the size of the team, this is the story for another day. That's why Oppo, we don't care who to ban team because they know who team. It doesn't matter if 10,000 fans are angry. There are still like millions and millions of other fans who are still okay, who are still following the Chiefs, who still love and appreciate the Chiefs. So, I I loko genga fun gwenze guti zveles accept and juguti I because this partnership has been here for the past 21 years. We should now tolerate being disrespected. Those are my thoughts. Let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next video. And until next time, remember, equals. Alpelu Moya.